what is up y'all it's your boy fat mike and i'm gonna end up making another video which is this yet again documenting all of the interactions that i put up with this asshole tyler allen testerman and i'm gonna give you a warning this video should be rated ma for mature ad audience only so fuck off youtube fuck off facebook with any shit there's the warning there's gonna be hella harsh language so it's not suitable for children so i better not get fucking any restrictions put on this video so i'm clearly going to be going over all of the text messages that was sent from him to me along with any videos that i had made showing his ass stuff so the next portion of the video i'm going to be scrolling through the few texts that i have it's not too much like my last few videos so yeah stick with me check it out like and share just so we can expose brain dead idiots i mean this asshole literally serves no real purpose in this world <laughs> check it out we'll start off with the first ones and shit and give you a little breakdown on this so he's saying to stop blocking him because he started off with contacting me again after three month time span where <clears throat> he was hiding from the cops and shit because <clears throat> they was trying to serve him charge papers for harassment and threatening and then he comes out of nowhere calls me doesn't say anything so i'm like this is a little sus you know it's a little suspect so i just blocked the number immediately like okay i feel like this is a scam shit or some nonsense so i just blocked it and then he starts off stop blocking me give me my weed back or else or else what you're gonna try to falsify charges on me again which will be a lot worse charge than what you could get me arrested for and once i show all the proof it's gonna write it's gonna clear my name and then you're gonna get fucking put in jail for fucking years for falsifying a police report because he tried to claim that oh I, he he stole it yeah i stole it that's why i have all the texts going over the names and strains and um how much what is and all that and talking about where i gave him the money where he came and met up and picked up the money and all that shit so i guess this dipshit i i really wouldn't surprise me that he would expect me to give him back the same shit that i got from him even though it's been over six months clearly i didn't buy the weed to look at the weed and just to hold on to the weed i bought the weed to smoke the weed so why would how would i be able to give him back that weed and on top of it i, I definitely wouldn't give him weed like the purple punch that i bought from the depot because the shit that i got is a whole hell of a lot stronger and pricier than the shit that he got me that day and on top of it why would i give you back something that i gave you money for because there ain't no discussion of Oh, you give me it back and I'll give you your money back. No, it's you give me it back or else. Well, I'm not just going to give you shit. And on top of it, instead of contacting me, stay the fuck out of my life. Take that money because say, say this, I wouldn't have gave it back to you without getting the money back or the equivalency back because I gave you money for the shit. So I'm not just going to give it back to you and not get anything in return so and, and even if that was the case why not just stay the fuck out of my life take that fucking money which would buy you the same equivalency 
at the depot and buy your weed and shut the fuck up. Stay the cl- completely out of my goddamn life. It's not that complicated. And you're not going to force somebody to have to put up with you. How about you come and try to force me to my face? How about you come and physically try to make me do that shit? Because I guarantee you, you're going to have this 9mm through your fucking head. I can promise you that. And that's no threat because he's talked about coming and home invading me. So if he comes into my house, I have the house doctrine. Me throwing around legal threats ain't the same thing as him pushing death threats, which that's where the state's attorney didn't want to help me. Oh, but you threatened him back. Um, yeah, but who fucking threatened and harassed first? I'm not just going to sit there, cry, and not do anything. And I'm certainly not just going to sit there and take it. No, I'm going to fucking dish back shit far worse than he could ever fucking say to me and i'm gonna call him out on every single little fucking thing so now he's back to harassing me and this is where we're at stop blocking me give me my weed back or else okay i get a hitman i mean this motherfucker cannot spell worth a fuck and i replied so also let's put it this way His will always be the dark gray, and mine will always be the green. So, I'm like, you're blocked. Stop contacting me. You sold the shit fair and square. You're broke ass. Well, this, I think, is where my fucking... Because I use voice to text, so it don't understand half of the shit that I say. Or it tries to think that I said something else. (sighs) Keep it up. I will make sure you rot in jail. Fucking loser. Got nothing better to do. Threaten me all you want. Go fuck yourself. No one is scared of you, and I'll be posting videos again. Good riddance, loser. Stop contacting me. I will get cops involved, which I've already proven that because I brought the fucking law into it before because he thinks he can do whatever he wants, whether it goes to breaking the law, killing somebody, And he literally thinks that no matter what the outcome is, no matter how bad a shit he does, he thinks that he is going to get away with it, even if everybody knows what the fuck he did. So say he thinks that the cops will just allow him to do whatever the fuck he wants. And then if he can't get his way, then he thinks that he can just get you locked up for whatever he wants to say you did, just like the far left. No factual evidence, just whatever I said he did, you're supposed to create the evidence. Oh yeah, this is originally the first one. Hi, it's Tyler. Why you block my number? Can I get my weed back? Why are you contacting me for this shit? You didn't get it back six months ago. You ain't getting anything now. Hell will freeze the fuck over before I do what this motherfucker demands me to. So I say yet again, stop fucking contacting me. I will go right and place shit on your dumb ass, you fucking loser. Get a fucking life or hang it the fuck up. You think you're going to get away with the harassment? If it's the last thing I do, I will make sure you get a wake-up call. Sad thing is the wake-up call will be what puts him out for eternity so it's a shame that you're gonna have to learn the hard way and then (laughs) you're not gonna breathe any longer after you get the fucking lesson and i'm like don't sell shit if you think you can get it back dumbass you a dealer go fuck off well he's a wannabe dealer (laughs) i'm like one more text and i will go file shit again i follow through unlike you Well, stop texting, calling, everything. I want nothing to do with your fake fat loser ass. You are not worth anyone's time. You deserve to rot alone. You are no friend. You never was a fucking friend. And you should be locked in a psychiatric ward for the rest of your life. Of course I blocked your harassing, annoying loser ass. You're fake in every way. I want nothing to do with you or anyone in your wretched family. You are the scum of the earth. 
How can't you get that through your head? I will never forgive you. Don't contact me. This number is blocked as well as will every number you contact me from will. We will never be friends again. Never, ever again. Bro, stop blocking me. I'm t telling Montana I'm untouchable, which he means I'm turning Montana. I'm untouchable. I know where you live at. You live by Caleb. I'm like, you ain't shit. Stop fucking contacting me, you fucking loser. Go shoot yourself or anything, but leave me the fuck alone. Then he continues, I'm coming for you. It's Tyler. Well, no shit, Sherlock. It's not going to be anybody else but this fat, pathetic loser. I got no issues with people but this fucker. At least the other people fucking get it through their fucking head that if I don't fucks with you, don't fuck with me. Because this motherfucker's doing nothing but letting his mouth write checks that his ass can't afford to cash. And I'm a come and collect motherfuckers. That's for damn sure. I'm like, follow through, pussy. Stop talking and do it already. Over six months, pussy. Fuck you. Come here and I'll blow you the fuck away. Try me, bitch. Come in my house and find out. You ain't welcome, so come follow through with those threats, bitch. Know what? I'm changing my goddamn number. Have fun. Because... All he does, I block a number, he makes a new one. I block that one, makes a new one. Over the last first span of the two months that I was dealing with this asshole and getting harassed, he had blocked about 20 numbers. And just in one day, I had to block six numbers already. I'm like, I will shoot you as soon as you come in my house. Try me, bitch. I'm not putting up with this bullshit, you pussy. Come fucking do it then, pussy. Test the house doctrine, pussy. You ain't gonna walk out the house. You may walk in. And then he goes, you're dead. I know where you live at now. You know what, fucker? No shit you know where I live. You brought me to my house one day. It shouldn't be that hard to remember. It's only a five minute fucking drive from you. And why wouldn't I do anything? You talk about coming and killing me. I, I would not allow a pathetic fuck like you to get the pleasure in that. Yeah, I'm really gonna fucking sit there and let you do whatever. Yeah. And I'm the fucking Pope. And pigs fucking fly. And Kamala Harris and Joe Biden are the most honest people in the fucking godforsaken universe, right? I got a Glock 19. I'm not scared to end somebody like him. I'm not. So if you want to fucking push, say all this shit, then come fucking do it. If, if, if you think I'm not going to do shit, then why do you go and turn from wanting to kill me to, oh, you better watch out. You better keep an eye on your truck. Oh, because what? You'll sneak up here and try to damage my vehicle because you're too fucking pussy to fucking face me and get shot in the face. Why? I'm not going to do anything, right? As you claim, because if you say it, that's how the world's got to be, right? Wrong, bitch. You're wrong in every fucking aspect of fucking life. Like, then do it, you fat, cowardly fuck. Stop talking it and fucking do it all. All you're doing is incriminating yourself, you stupid, fat, losing. I think I tried to say skank and it put stats. Fucking bastard ass fuck. I meant to go say go rape your mom more fucking loser. I'm walking to your house and you won't do nothing. I'll eat all your food. I'm like, why wouldn't I do something? You're talking about killing me. So I'm going to defend myself. You're dead in so many ways. Oh, you can only kill a person one time. So how are you going to kill me in multiple ways? That's improbable, Tyler. You stupid fucking brain dead retarded fuck. Must have been a crack baby, motherfucker. You really must have been a crack baby. Your mom ain't no goddamn better than your worthless piece of shit ass. And if she knew what fucking was good for, she'd fucking ditch your fucking ass. Cause she gonna be guilty by association. Yeah, sure you will see. Because you're too fucking coward to come and do the shit that you claim you can. Just like on the last two months, 
I got nothing but stupid ass texts. Oh, I'm Ryan Upchurch. Oh, I'm a UFC fighter. Oh, I'm a porn star on fucking uh, OnlyFans. Yeah, um, OnlyFans people ain't real porn stars, motherfucker. The only people that'd be paying you anything is to put your fucking clothes back on, you stupid fuck. You're like twice my size. So, yet again. Oh, and see, I will see what happens to, to your truck tonight. Well, what happened to you home invading me, bitch? What happened to that? Because you know you're going to get shot. You're going to get shot either fucking way, dude. I find you next to my truck. You won't fucking know I'm there until you feel that cold barrel to the back of your head straight the fuck up. So I'm like, stop saying it. Fucking do it. You low life, no fucking. Uh, you don't got shit better to do with your life because you're a nobody. You were nobody, like, and nobody wants anything to do with you. The more you harass me is not going to get me to give you your way. So that shit I bought, I didn't steal it like you try to make it out. And I still have all the goddamn text messages from day one. And like I said, I gave you all a warning because I'm just going to, I'm brutal with this motherfucker. Because I'm not going to fucking sit there and be nice and put up with the shit. No. You want to be a little fucking scum fucker? I'm going to treat you like garbage, motherfucker. If anybody, if fucking Joe Biden wants to fucking execute some people, that's the type of people he needs to fucking execute. I'm like, I'm a block from Caleb's. I can see the back of his house. Come and find me, pussy. Come and break into my house and see where that fucking gets you. Because I promise you, promise you, fat bastard, it will be utterly the last literal fucking thing you do in your life so come and try me harm me and see where that fucking gets you bitch i ain't scared of you you are annoying little pussy ass prick you can cry a river i don't give a fuck so actually fucking nut up or shut up because you're fucking harassing me on the phone ain't nothing that some gangster would do you little pussy ass cocksucker Yet again, he goes back to threatening me, but we all know he's a coward. I'm coming for you. You live right behind Caleb. What I just said, dumbass. And I know the neighborhood and everything. Keep an eye out for me tonight, and we'll keep an eye out for you, your truck. Yet again, your truck. Not you. You keep an eye out for us, and we'll... And we'll keep an eye out for your truck. Honestly, I don't even think this fat bastard even remember what my truck looked like. <clears throat> and I'm like, fucking do it. You talk a bunch of shit, but you ain't fucking walk it. And then I don't even know why he brought this shit up. You're just mad no girl one show. Females have nothing to do with you harassing me. Regardless if I have a girl with me or not, it's not dictating whether or not you contact me with stupid shit, pointless shit, starting shit that you know you can't finish. It's what he's good at. Keep on your truck. I know where exactly you're at now. And the cops ain't going to help you. I'm turning Montana. I paid them all. Yeah, uh, like he said last time, oh, I pay them a dollar a day. You couldn't afford even that. And know what, Huzzy? They don't work for broke-ass fucks like you. Not even a fucking crackhead would work for you that cheap, you stupid fuck. That wouldn't even pay cover the fucking bills for them. So why would they fucking waste their time on you? Because I can guarantee you, a real fucking kingpin don't pay their protection a dollar a day. Is this back in fucking like the 1600s or some shit? Because like, uh, think about inflation, dipshit. You support the motherfucker that's made it the way it is. I'm like, shut your fat blabbermouth the fuck up. And you either fucking do it or you shut the fuck up. But right now, this makes you look like the fucking real pussy. You're trying to be a little keyboard tough guy. Well, I was like, go stalk, do shit to somebody who gives a fuck about you. I could care less if I heard you died on the fucking news tomorrow. You ain't worth. <sighs> I will, I promise, enjoy your last day on earth. You won't do shit. You're a bitch. Yeah, I'm just going to let you fucking physically attack me. <laughs> 
I may be a godly person, but know what? I'm also a fucking warrior. So I'll be more than gladly to take a fucking life out of anything. I won't hesitate to take my attackers' lives, but I won't be harming innocent people. So if you're wanting to come and attack me, Tyler, you're not innocent. So I will be more than gladly to do God's work and eradicate you off the face of this fucking planet. You won't do shit. You're a bitch. We'll see who do something. It's going to start with you tonight. Yeah, that's why when I sent you the little video of the bullets, that's why you're like, oh, I'm calling the cops. Look what I got, Tyler. These are all for you. Stop being a pussy, bitch. Like, oh, I finally got something on him that he can get arrested for. I'm not on probation, bitch. I'm allowed to have a fucking gun. Don't be the idiot that brings a knife to a gunfight. Because I'll be the fucking one to bring a gun to a knife fight, bitch. Fuck out of here. Just because you want to fucking, like, you don't get to dictate everything, dude. You don't. You don't get to control every aspect of life just so you can control it to make it to make it impossible for you to lose because that's not how life works. So how about you come and do the shit? Because I catch you messing with my car, I'm gonna give my car a new paint job. It'll be red. And I'm gonna call it Tyler's Red. Or Tyler's Insides. That'll be the fucking paint job it'll be called. I'm like, come and get the fuck over with Karen. You little pussy ass bitch, stop talking shit. All you do is talk, 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 and you never fucking do shit. You are a annoying little piece of fucking trash. Go fucking yourself or come kick this door in and see where the fuck that gets you because me blocking you ain't doing a goddamn thing. So I'm going to have plenty of fucking reasons to defend myself. Come kick my goddamn door in and have your fucking brains everywhere. I'm waiting, you fucking coward. Come and get it over with so I don't have to deal with your worthless ass anymore. Get it over with, pussy. Stop talking and start walking. And then he tries to relate this shit to GTA. You see how you play GTA? That's going to be your life, but it ain't going to be, which I didn't even fully read the shit. I assume that because he mentioned GTA, I automatically thought that he was like trying to relate it to the game, but like uh, how... There's no relating it when, like, of course, this is real life dipshit. If somebody gets killed, there is no coming back. So why did you bring up GTA? I don't even play GTA with this motherfucker. So why bring that up? I mean, he, like, why does God allow such stupid fucking beings on this planet? This is why we need shit to be like the Wild West. So we can actually go and just like, like, for example, and I'm saying an example, YouTube and Facebook. For an example, if the shit ran like the Wild West, that means that, say, this motherfucker just wanted to run his mouth. He would never fucking come over here. Well, then that I would never have to worry about going to jail. So I could immediately go find him and I could lay him out on the street and leave his body there to rot. Like we could sit there and watch the vultures eat their shit in that state. And you would never have to worry about going to jail. For an example too, that asshole that came and, and tried to attack me and I gotta pay fucking damages for his goddamn truck. Well, let's put it this way. In that type of state, I could have fucking killed him and I could have took his goddamn truck and left him to rot in the street and there would have nothing been allowed to have happened to me except for maybe somebody to avenge him if he has anybody to avenge him which clearly tyler doesn't not in this fucking state not in that one either i was like this is real life motherfucker this ain't fucking GTA. There ain't no fucking coming back. Once you go down, so bring it, you fucking pussy. Or I'm gonna make hella fucking videos about your fucking big fat pussy stank ass. You'll disappear tonight just like your truck. I think he just wants to steal my truck just so he... Like, like, dude, if you harmed me, you wouldn't be able to keep the truck 
dumbass. Yeah, I'm gonna come and kill you, and then I'm gonna just drive around your truck so I don't have to borrow my mommy's truck anymore. You couldn't afford the fucking insurance on it, bitch. You couldn't afford the gas in that shit, because mommy lets you sit at home do absolutely nothing, gives you fucking money for food on top of all your food stamps, which he gets from the fucking EBT program. Yet, if mommy fucking supports you so much, you shouldn't be allowed to collect those food stamps. So you are technically caught lying on your fucking application. And your mommy ain't part of your EBT shit, so you shouldn't even be, you should be kicked off of that fucking program. And know what, when they kick motherfuckers off, they should really fucking ban them so these motherfuckers can just go and starve to death. I would love to watch this motherfucker starve to death. I would actually eat shit in front of him. I'd fucking throw shit in the trash before I'd even fucking hand it to his ass. So I said, do it. I'm locked and loaded, bitch, bring it. I'm like, see, you ain't nothing but talk. So I'm changing my fucking number, and you ain't gonna fucking get it. We see tonight when I blow your truck up. Oh, now terroristical threatening now. He's really up in the fucking charges on himself now. You can't fight just disabled? Well, I'm not just gonna fight with you for the fuck of it. And then, even if I did fight with you, beat your ass, then you'd go run to the cup. He did this to me for no reason. Arrest him. See, he's the type of person that he, he, he'll call you a snitch for calling the cops, but he'll, he would even be quicker to do the shit himself if the shoe was on the other foot. He's nothing but a fucking hypocrite. He's the worst kind of hypocrite. I'm like, you ain't gonna make it up the stairs, fat fuck, because I would blow his fucking head off his fucking shoulders before he even made it halfway up the steps. Y you're not bulletproof, stupid fuck. Even if he had a bulletproof vest on, headshot, done, straight up. I'm like, so you're gonna be in my home, so I don't give a fuck. I'ma end the shit now. GTA versus Israel life. You're the fucking dummy, dummy. Like, GTA is a game. There ain't no restart in real life. You're one and done. I see you outside. Stop talking, get the fuck here. Come bust my door in, bitch. Summer, blow your truck up tonight. Watch and see. Keep an eye out on it tonight and let you go bye-bye. What, am I supposed to die just because you blow up my truck? Trust and believe, you'll be paying restitution. And then all your disability money will come to me, motherfucker, and I'll fucking have all your fucking money for the rest of your life. Like, you ain't gonna do shit. You're bored, nothing to do. Go fuck yourself. Changing the number now. You won't have my next. You can't come to my fat look at you look like fat joe why would i come to you because clearly you're just trying to find a way like like really what he's trying to do he's trying he thinks that he can piss me off so i just barge over there and what call the cops say oh he's gonna kill me i need help well let's put it this way fucker i'm not gonna be calling the cops until after you have no more air in your lungs. So you ain't gonna fucking go to jail, motherfucker. I'ma send you straight to hell. I'm like, you wanna do shit, well come here. It ain't gonna be your way, bitch. No, GTA 5 is real life, dummy. Oh, what? I guess he thinks that he can just get shot and then he'll just like come back and ha have unlimited attempts? I, like, dude, this. Oh my god. Like, we should literally put brain dead idiots like this down like rabbit animal all he does is drain tax money and people like him should not be allowed to collect any fucking benefits you're the stupidest person alive yet you're the one that said no gta 5 is real life dummy you really said dummy after saying that yourself but i'm the stupidest i think you need to look in the fucking mirror because that's the dumbest motherfucker you will ever fucking know and that's yourself, Tyler Allen Testerman. That's his whole goddamn name. And I'm a fucking keep on saying it so everybody knows how much of a fucking worthless piece of shit he is. Yeah, it's kind of hard to meet you when you won't even come on the block, let alone in my neighborhood, because you're too much of a fucking coward. Like, even if you did shit to my truck, the cops ain't going to be like, hmm, who could have done this? Couldn't have possibly have been Tyler. Who else do you have issues with? Because I don't have issues with nobody else. Just this fat, pathetic, low-life fuck. I'm like, I'm done talking. Either do it or get the fuck out of my life, pussy. I'm like, no, you kick my door in. You say you're going to eat my house out, steal my shit, come in and see what's waiting. 
I'm like, this has nothing to do with females. You the one who ain't even got female. I was like, you ain't even got male friends because we ain't going to put up with your garbage. White trash bitch. Come and get some lead, fucker. But you're scared. Talk big. Nothing to show for it. I haven't done shit because you too much a pussy to show. Want to run your mouth at a distance so you can't get murk. I'm like, you had your mommy move y'all just to run from the charges about the charges i placed on him for harassment and all the death threats and shit and you talk about me not doing shit i don't run my mouth saying shit and then not do it haven't done shit because i don't know where your scared ass moved to you ain't at the same apartment because you got scared and ran for your life don't gotta do much to make your fat bitch ass jump. Look who the one hiding. Your punk ass bitch self hiding. Running your mouth behind a keyboard. Cause you know I don't have any remorse for you. I won't care if I have to finish you. I'll do what's got to be done. Come try me if you think you so tough fat boy. Give me your address then you so tough. Come and get destroyed. Come home and invade me. That's right, you won't. You're a bitch, biggest bitch in the world. And you're the dummy. You're the one trying to compare GTA to real life. You stupid fuck. In real life, you get headshot, you ain't coming back from that. You're the idiot who thinks this a game. Like, I'm not your mommy. I don't have to put up with your shit. And I will never. I will always refuse. You're not worth my goddamn time. I will celebrate your death no matter how you go. I'm gonna throw a goddamn party that night. That's how much you mean to me absolutely shit. Zero percent. I won't lose any sleep. You and mommy ran away to escape the shit you put yourself in last time. If you had shit in in your worthless name, they would easily find your garbage ass. You either show up or stop fucking contacting me cause it's pointless. Your coward ass, too scared to do shit. Even show your face or do even one thing you threaten to do cause you have no balls. You're not a man or even a boy. You're a little sissy bitch hiding behind your phone. I will shove that phone down your throat and watch you choke. See how well you text me after that. You're not costing me anything to change my number, but how about you get your own fucking life and keep to yourself? You are not intimidating. You're really not. It will be like ending a bug's life how quick you will go. I catch you over here. You have been warned. I will be more than happy to prove it. But come out of hiding, pussy. Trust and believe the videos I make more and more people will make fun of you. I'm the one in the right. You're in the wrong. And nobody supports fake fucks like you. Yeah, and then he went to this shit. Then he just switches it randomly up. I want to be friends. And remember last time you tried taking me to court, it didn't work because he couldn't find me. So you can try it again, but it's not going to work. I got them in my pocket. I told you, I'm t telling Montana. The only reason why it didn't work last time is because you're hiding, you pussy. You fucking admit that you are a coward. You you can't even fucking deal the shit that you fucking created. That's how pathetic he is. And I'm sure that they won't be much of an effort to find your fucking killer if somebody so happens to make you fat ass disappear. I'm positive on that, Tyler. But it's not going to work. I got them in my pocket. You hiding? isn't them in your pocket. If you had them in your pocket, why would you be hiding from the cops if they worked for you, dipshit? Exactly, they don't work for you. That's why you had to fucking hide. That's why you got your mom and yourself kicked out of that apartment so she would have to get another one and yet again continue to fucking put a roof over your worthless head so you can use all of your disability money to go and blow it all on weed and then what money your fat ass can't fucking get 
with food stamps, your mommy will feed you the rest of the shit. That's why you're so goddamn fat. That's why you're fucking over 300 pounds, you stupid, worthless fuck. You couldn't even walk down to the goddamn gas station to get a blunt wrap. And that wasn't even a goddamn quarter mile round trip. And this little fat fuck wouldn't even walk down there. I'm telling Montana, you can try to get a restraining order on me, but that's not going to work neither. I know all of your moves. You live right behind Caleb. So I'm coming for your bitch ass. So try me now. You all talk. I'm not the one that's all talk. You are the one that made all these threats about coming to me. So if you want me to come to you, give me your address then, pussy. But you won't because you're hiding. But Tyler... I'm going to make you disappear, whether I got to drag you out of hiding or your dumb ass come and get dealt with. I'm like blocked. I'm like, you ain't trying to be a friend. You're trying to force me to do shit. You ain't going to give me my money back. So go fuck yourself. And at that rate, you can go get more, which you did with the money that day, dumbass. I'm done, Tyler. I'm changing my number. Thanks but I'll be damned you get my next loser. Nobody wants a two-face as a friend. You are impossible to be someone's friend. Get a life, one where I'm not part of it. No sorry on this earth can make me forgive you. You can rot in hell for all eternity, and that still won't be good enough. I'm like, you do anything to any of my property of mine or my family's, you will have a warrant out for your arrest. And that will never go away until they lock you up and charge your ass. It won't be as petty. Dude, I really fucking wished Apple would get their goddamn shit working right. It won't be as petty as just me pressing charges. They will put a warrant out for your arrest for damaging property. And trust and believe, you won't have a single fucking thing of yours. It will all be ash. I will make sure you never have a pot to piss in. And you have already pre-admitted to the sort of the crime. And there is no one else I have issues with. But your fat, pathetic, low-life, white trash, garbage ass. So trust and believe they're only going to be looking for your fat, low-life ass. Nobody else. You're going to be prime suspect, bitch. And if the law won't do shit, trust and believe I will. Because I'm a man of my word. But you don't know anything about that type of life. If I catch you around my shit, you will be in the back of my shit. And no one will ever see or hear from you again. You have my word on that. Keep fucking with me. It will be the last fucking thing you try on the face of this godforsaken plan. This is the last thing that he stated. You will never be safe again. And I will do something when you don't know it. How pathetic and how sneakily is he trying to be because he is a fucking pussy well how are you going to attack me without me knowing it how, how like like oh it sounds like you just want to damage stuff what put me into the same place as you uh so i lose a job don't have a car and gotta live off of my mommy like you do trust me you're gonna hear a bang and it's gonna be lights the fuck out promise you there's gonna be some fucking animals eating good that night and then see i'm going to the cops you say you was going to kill me i'm telling my mom on you i'm telling my mom i'm going to the cops right now because they work for me i did fuck my mom once wow dude wow yo <laughs> wow yo <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I got death threats from you. It's not against the law to defend myself, bitch. I got every, I got every message from every number. May have blocked you, but I save everything, dipshit. Go fuck yourself. While you at it, tell them how you keep threatening me and harassing me. Go ahead and try to put a restraining order on me. You know what? I'm not even going to waste my time. So if the only thing he's going to do is harass me on the phone, then I'm just going to change my fucking number so he can't get the pleasure of being able to annoy me. If I ever catch his fat ass on my property, I'm going to fucking put every goddamn that I have into his fat fucking ass. So I hope you hear this fucking Tyler. If I catch you around my truck doing anything to any of my property or on my property, you are a goner. 
I'm like, pussy, talk big, won't do shit. You're a two-faced fuck. Thank you. Oh, yeah. And then I'll throw that fucking clip in because the shit that he was talking about calling the cops on and telling his mommy on me about what your mommy gonna do. You wanna lie to me and Leon? She can go down with your fat fucking ass. Think you're gonna be protected while you do wrong? You are completely retarded yourself. Save the world the time. I'm telling on you. And I'm like, no, they don't. Shut the fuck up. You ain't got nothing better to do than waste people's time. Hope you enjoy making numbers, fucker. I'm getting your bitch ass. You're gonna rot under the jail. I'm telling my daddy Joe Biden on you. I'm like, get it out now. You won't get my new number. No, you're going to jail for saying you're going to kill me. Watch cops are in my pocket. If it was that easy to fucking get somebody arrested just for saying they're going to kill you while well, you have done it thousands of times to me. So therefore, it would it, it would have been even easier to get you arrested if that was the case. Trust and believe, Tyler. When I do find out your address, you're not going to know about it until the cops are fucking serving your fucking ass next time, bitch. You ain't going to have time to run next time, fucker. I'm going to give you a fucking big surprise, bitch. And I said, I wish you would come and do the shit you say, pussy, but you don't got the balls to follow through. You're going to be put under the jail, fucker. Come do shit, pussy. And yet again, another terroristical threat. Blow your car up. I'll make sure you're in it. I'm like, I'm going to show the world how much of a bitch you are. Already made one video. You want to go for two in one day, loser? I'll blow you up with a rocket launcher. Terroristical threat. And I'll shoot you far, far away with a shotgun. Does this motherfucker think he can snipe people with a shotgun? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this ain't a game, dog. There is a thing called fucking bullet drop, bitch. Like, and a fucking shotgun is for close quarters. <laughs> this shows you how much this idiot knows about shit. Oh, God, yo. Oh, God. And I mean, with his fucking disabilities and shit, he would never be able to fucking purchase a fucking firearm. <laughs> I'm like, see, you can't do wrong and get protection by the law. You are brain dead, yo. Play in traffic. Where your pussy at? You won't come to me. That's why I have a scope around you right now. I'm looking at you right now with a scope. It's on my shotgun. Then why? If you wanted to kill me so fucking badly, then why don't you try to take the shot? Because you don't. And you, you don't have a shotgun or a fucking scope. Nor are you fucking looking at me, you stupid fucking loser. I wished God would make this son of a bitch die the most slowest, most painful, agonizing, possible fucking death of all, this motherfucker needs to suffer. And then there's the video. Do it then, bitch. Stop being a fucking pussy and thinking you're just gonna run your mouth all goddamn night long, you fucking loser. You have nothing else to do. So you can't get anybody else's attention, so you gotta harass somebody just to get attention from them because you're so worthless and nobody wants to be around you. How about you come over and do the shit already, bitch? Because I am so fucking tired of hearing your idiocracy. I am ready to end it. So come over and get what you got coming, you huzzy. You talked about home invading me. Come kick my door in, bitch. And get dealt with like you begging to. Get it in while you can, bitch, because I'm changing my number and you ain't never going to be able to call me, text me, or fucking look me up, bitch. They work for you last time? No, they didn't do shit. And then that's it, green light. 
And I'm like, terroristic threats are a serious matter. That's a serious offense, Tyler. Because, see, he thinks that he's just doing misdemeanor shit now. Well, that, ty- uh, that terroristical threats, well, that's a federal fucking felony, motherfucker. You ain't gonna go to fucking Harford County Detention Center or even DOC for that matter, bitch. Give you the meat cock sandwich. But you'd enjoy that. That's probably why you don't got no teeth in your front and shit, because you bit on your boyfriend's dick too hard and he knocked him out. So all you can do is gum a dick now. Like, been telling you, shut up and do it. Want to talk all that shit, but clearly you're not man enough to follow through. I wish you would do the shit so I can watch you destroy what life you have, even though it ain't much of one. You're the worst of white trash in this universe. Fake, 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 fake. You will never fake it till you make it. You will always be fake. Why do shit when I won't know it because you such a pussy, you want to damage stuff because you're too scared to get dealt with personally. Either way, the cop's going to be coming for you. Anything that happens to mine or my family shit, they will have a warrant for you and they will get your loser ass and I'm gonna get you for terroristic threats and I'm like that's a lot worse than harassment thanks for the proof dummy how about you try not admitting to shit all you doing is telling on yourself but just shows how pathetic your worthless ass is I'll pray you get the balls to attack me anything happens to my property I I'll make it my life goal You won't have a single thing, not a pot to piss in or a roof to put your fat, worthless ass under. Destroy one thing and watch everything you own go to ash. You are absolutely the dumbest fucking human I have ever known. I doubt I'll find anything more stupid than your dumbass. I promise you the demons I'll bring to you, hell won't come close to the wrath I'll bring upon your head that's what i really meant but i don't know why voice to text can't understand upon because that's a real fucking word i'm like you think you hard just showing how much the bitch you really are go from killing me to damaging my car because you're scared to face me lmao You're a fucking joke. Kill yourself, save me the time. I'm like, you're fighting a losing battle that you will never win. Give up. I don't owe you shit. If you think I do, you're beat. Deal with it, bitch. How about don't be an Indian seller because you definitely didn't give me it. You sold it and then think I'm supposed to give it back for free? That shit was smoked months ago. How you think I got that same shit just show how brain dead your shit really is. I'm like, you're beat. Deal with it. Shut the fuck up. Stay out of my life. Go find someone to annoy. Not me, because you're going to regret fucking with me. The longer it goes on, the worse it will be for you. Trust and believe that I will make sure you pay for whatever you do. You're a puny, annoying demon, bitch. I will show you where darkness comes from and I'll do the Lord's bidding and and destroy blasphemous garbage like you. Talking a bunch, a big shit. Don't make you a big man. In fact, I actually have no respect for you. Zero percent. Now, if you actually followed through on your words... I'll still deal with you the same way, but at least I'll have some respect. But you're no man. You're no boy. You're a little fucking bitch. A little slut skank. Get back out on that street corner and continue sucking dick, you toothless fuck. I catch you around my car. You're going to end up in the back of it. No one will ever have to put up with your pathetic bullshit. Let me catch you fucking with my shit. Like, come on, pussy. Don't start shit you can't finish, bitch. Just proves 
how much a bitch you really are show exactly how fake your fucking loser ass is. You ain't got me mad. I'm better than you in every way possible. I'm better than you in every way possible. I will go to heaven while you burn in hell, you fake fuck. I wish you would follow through. I'd put you in your place quick without breaking a sweat or even getting a tiny scratch because you're gonna be squashed like a bug just as quick too. And it will be a one and done. So I won't have to put up with your annoying ass ever the fuck again because I will permanently silence your ass. Home invade me like you claim. You're gonna, you fucking coward big mouth. No fucking ball. Come let your ass cash the checks that your mouth fucking wrote. I'm like, trust me, you won't have to worry about going to jail. If only your little pussy ass would come and attempt the shit that you threaten so dearly because they'll be taking you out in a goddamn body bag. You won't be arrested. The coroner will be collecting your ass from my house. But you're too scared because you know you will get destroyed and you can't be Tony Montana because your words are just bullshit nonsense. And you don't have any testicles so you can't say all you have is your balls and your word and you don't break either because you crush the shit out of them yourself you little sissy faggot i'm like see unlike you i don't run my mouth unless i'm damn well willing to do what i threaten to do i have no respect for garbage like you and my cousin knows you from back in the day and he says that you're nothing but trash you're nothing but a pathetic loser always have been and you always be you're a compulsive liar, that's all you will ever be. You serve no real purpose in this world, and people like you should be eradicated off the face of this planet. All you do is try to fucking sit on your ass and have others support you, because you will never amount to shit. You ain't even... The fuck, dude, I wish fucking voice to text actually. Like, see, they tell you, oh, you gotta have this on and it has to listen to you to understand you. Well, all it does is listen to you and fucking give them recordings of your ass, but it never fucking learns from you. So we clearly see that that's a fucking bullshit lie. Fuck Apple, dude. But I believe this is the last of the texts. All right, so I hope y'all enjoyed the video. I'm sure there'll be more until I change my number. I'm debating on whether or not I should actually change it today or not, because if this motherfucker would actually stop calling me, I've had this number for shit since I lived in Rising Sun, so I, I, I honestly, I really don't want to change my number, because I already have this shit memorized. Like, it, like the back of my hand, I know my fucking number, so I, I really don't want to have to change it, but it's not going to cost me anything, just to let you know, Tyler, because you're harassing me though they're gonna do it for free so you're not costing me any money you're just making me change my number when i don't want to but how about you just delete my fucking number because you have nothing worthwhile to talk to me about you really don't so you either show up here or you have nothing to fucking say empty threats are pointless so you either nut up or shut up. Just like Tallahassee. Nut up or shut up. But you're too brain dead to understand that. So, if you like the video, please give me a thumb, give it a thumbs up. And if you'd like, please share. Help me help get my channel recognized and please if you have not already, please hit that subscribe button if you would. But I'm your boy Fat Mike, and I am out. Deuces.